let's just get it over with with Armika. Action! Jumping like kick, standing like a stomp chomp, shooting peach. This is new. I don't know about that one. Am I doing an old trial? No. Hold this. The oh boy, we gotta do all this. Oh god. And then uh, Lady Mika, which is this heated mic performance. That's not even Visco Two. Is this the right one? She couldn't HP Peach before. Oh, so that's it. But probably the other stuff. That's a little more corner carry. That's cool. Okay, sure, 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 sure. Oh, I probably gotta walk up a little bit or something. Just show me. Mm -mm. Yeah, you walk up. Okay. You ain't tell me nothing about no dash. Okay. Okay. There's no walk up. Can you tell me that? Sure. Oh what? Got me sounding like smug. <laughs> Is this even gonna be good? I might have to walk up a little bit more. What? Oh, I'm not holding it, am I? What? It's an uppercut, right? Oh, wait, 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 how do you do this move? Oh, it's not an uppercut, it's a quarter circle board, okay. Army. <laughs> Hitbox, Hitbox players, am I right? Oops! Easiest thing, you don't even got a dash up, see, new tech. Hitbox players, am I right? Dang, it didn't even demonstrate nothing, but I guess there is nothing to demonstrate with the parry, because you gotta get attacked for it. So the question is, do you get Oki and is it on frame three, frame two? Probably not. Probably frame three. Probably no Oki, just like Bongs. And then we gotta see what else she got. What does she have? Why does she have a parry? I don't, she, I don't I feel like she don't need it. Pumped up! I think you beefy Godzilla. You can counter attack, okay. I don't think you get Oki. Does it give you any benefits? Like make your grab stronger? Low, lower stage attacks? What in the... Projectiles, EX, critical arts. So only normals that are... Only high normals. Maybe jump-ins. That seems super risky. You just crouch medium punch and get Oki. I'm looking at the meter that it's building. Well. Okay, thank you. <laughs> Thanks, game. It's like they don't have an, uh, they didn't have a really good idea of what to do. Year three. It's plus if it's blocked. So that means they can, does that mean it's slow? Where are we gonna go? Go to the beach. Put our dancing shoes on. Rainbow Mika. Uh, yeah, sure. Do what you gotta do, Mika. Let me get that max CPM. <laughs> How do you do the codes? Is it hold down in these combinations? I don't even know if this is a code. I don't know if this is a code or if it works. Rival schools. That's so crazy that these rival school characters are in the back. Isn't that Hinata and Tiffany? Okay, what they done do? What they done did? She, Karen, Alcim, Alejandro. Must be further back. Was there anything? Uh, nope. 
Kali. Here we go. Wow, this is gonna be the shortest. This might be the shortest video. Standing like it changed with a hurt box will not move backwards. That's a nerf, and I'm happy about that. This might be similar to Laura's standing light kick, where her her hurt box is not really present. Well, it doesn't move forward that much, which is why it's it's good for like a counter poke. So maybe they did something similar for her. Maybe I'm making that up. <laughs> Who knows? Ah, yeah. So she she actually moved backwards with this move. According to this, I don't know if you can see it that well. Yeah, you can see it. Like right here, she moved backwards with stand light kick. Por qué? Uh, why? Why was that? She can't do it no more, though. Stand medium punch. Opponent blocking the active frames will give an advantage in recovery. The opponent blocking the active, active frames will give it. Did this not work for meaties? I don't know what that means. Can I put a friend? Did this not have like a meaty property to it? We got two active frames. Call it a bug fix. Okay. It's up plus all punches. I think there was a light kick thrown in there too. I don't know. So yeah, this is the buff. Shooting Peach will combo from Stomp Chomp. I think you get medium Peach before. So plus 10 on medium. Plus 10 still. So it's a little more corner carry. 147 damage. 155. So it's like a damage buff, distance, more corner carry buff. Does that mean shooting Peach is faster? It didn't say that. So it's a, it's a difference to Stomp Chomp, but it only says that shooting Peach is possible. I guess that's the only other thing. Added a forward input version for the... Oh. Does she, uh... Does she throw it? Later? Oh! And I'm plus three when I dash. Plus five? It goes what? What? Can't you see I'm in the middle of something? Capcom Friendship Network? Not again. I thought we were done with this. <laughs> This is not the first time it happened while I'm trying to make some, some content over here. Uh, where were we? Rainbow Mika. Yeah. Sakura. Yeah. Let's go. Can't even do training mode in peace. Oh, I'm okay, you're right. I did skip crouching medium punch. Reduce the backwards hitbox. That's a nerf. And expanded upwards and backwards hip hurt box. Oh, so it's gonna be harder to use this against cross-ups. So it's not gonna be, dare I say, um, I don't dare to say that. <laughs> it's gonna be more difficult to use this. You can't offend anybody in 2019. So yeah, that is gonna be, that's like half of the, half of the hitbox, nearly half of it. Like 40% of it got chunked away. So it's gonna be harder to use this against cross ups. And she's much fatter. Dang it, 2019. She's, uh, um, um, do you know what I'm saying? <laughs> it's going to be harder to use as an anti-air. Uh, here's my thing, man. A lot of characters have this. You just do a jump back button if you need to. Use her anti-air. She's got one, you know. Should be all right. It's not going to be as simple as they're in the air. Boop, mix up. But you can still use this. It's still going to be fine. It wasn't really that good for cross-ups, nor near as good as birdies. Yeah, but birdies is... Birdies and Laura's anti-air medium punches are stupid. Stupid. But whatever. They gotta, you know, someone's gotta have it. <laughs> yeah, I mean, she's gotta learn how to be like Sagat. <laughs> you know what it's like to whip a tiger uppercut? And all you gotta do is, boop, free Oki. Come on, man. You gotta hit jump back jab sometimes. Or... You know, watch where you watch where you stepping, man. Be right here, and then then you'd be all right. Wingless airplane is pretty trash as an anti-air. Let's take a look. Cause I, I hear Alex players saying the same thing about like ex ex. Uh, you know, air knee smash. That's not really good against the crossups. So let's see. That is not gonna work now, right? Not well. 
<laughs> it still kind of works, but it's not nearly as good. Do you get Oki after this? What? Hold on. You probably get Oki after this, right? This trash anti air? No, you. Yeah, you do. You do. I just gotta use the side that I'm doing. It's side switches. Plus plus two. Trash anti air, huh? I think it's fine. Doesn't her jump medium punch? I think it's just a normal anti air button, right? No, it causes a juggle, but you're not gonna really use this for that reason. Like, this would be good like this, but you barely ever see it like that. It's not really how it's gonna work. It causes a juggle, but you're not gonna really see it that way too much. But, if you are at that angle where the jump in is gonna be difficult to hit because it's crossing up, jump back medium punch is good because it knocks them down. So, you reset the neutral and you have advantage in the neutral, but you're not gonna get Oki or nothing like that. But it's better than this. It's better than jump back jab, but jump back jab, like it, whichever one's faster and has a better hitbox, they're both going to be able to replace that down medium punch, but not in the way that it's going to give you the same Oki. That's fine. I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. I'm, I'm, these are clear nerfs for Armika, but the V skill, what, before I was rudely interrupted by CFN, that would be, I want to see how far this really goes. What? What? And I bet that builds more bar too. This makes her command grab more more damaging, and uh, I bet it's gonna give me two bars. Yup. So when it hits, I also get it. God dang. That's a buff. That's a clear buff. Hermika was having trouble getting in in the, in the neutral. <laughs> she was having trouble uh, zoning in. So now you can zone in while you build your meter. And your command grab. That's really good, I think. I never noticed the noises that it makes. Does she say different things? It's like random too. It just says whatever. Uh, is that it? V trigger one, fighting dirty. V trigger two, change so that if the Deshko attack and Mika's throw hit the opponent at the same time, the Deshko attack will take priority. I think this maybe has to do with unblockables. They happen at the same time. Mika throws, throw hit the opponent at the same time. Oh, you'll still be able to do unblockables if you jump and then she hits you. That's a weird change. I think we're done here. <laughs> we can look at the startup for her parry. This might take a little bit to pull out. Pull up, mouth up. Mouth up. I forgot where I got that from. Why does it make you go to another slide to get to the frame data? I mean to nitpick. Where's it at? Should be V system. Pumped up. This is V skill two. Successful parry plus four on block. I'm not sure how you would do that. It just depends on how big the startup is here. Maybe against jump attacks they can block. It is three frames, massive recovery, subject to counter hit. Uh, it's really weird. They buff V skill one, so you have even less incentive to use V skill two. But that, I mean, that shouldn't be how you approach it. They should both be, you know, have something good. If she can block here, I suck. Oh, I got the uh, one. You can't use it like that. <laughs> what? Okay, I might have to block a little bit longer. But I think this would be the way to get it to work. Plus four? Isn't plus four too much? I think a command grab would whip here. I can't do it. It's kind of four. I gotta use like I guess. <laughs> okay, how about jab? Right there. 
that's a bit too far. But if it, I don't know if it's if it's too far or if it's the plus frames. Let's try to just delay it a little bit. Oh, you just gotta wait. I think her command grab. If her command grab is five, that explains it. Because they'll still be in throwing vulnerability at four. I guess we look at the amount of meter that it builds. You can't use it against projectiles. So let's just try, I guess, dash up heavy kick. I want some dive food today. Go down for some dive food. Oh, dive food. Always. Always. And I need them to get up. Is that a hard knockdown? Uh? Ow. Do it, football head. Dang it. Is that a hard knockdown? Word? That's kind of good. Four. I guess you just dash up a lot. What else does she have for like a spring kill? Dash. Dash three times plus eight. So it's probably 16 times three plus eight. 16, 32, 32, 48, plus eight, 56, plus 56, something like that. I don't know. How many active frames do we got? Two? Ten. Oh, okay. Ten. This is out. Okay, okay. It's, it's not 2, it's 10. That is a lot of active frames. I guess it's in comparison to EX Shooting Peach. The armor move. You get Oki off of that too. But this will save you meter and give you Oki. It's not bad. It's kind of weird. And it also doesn't work against low attacks. I don't know. I don't think it would help against someone like Dalsam either. The punch is probably not even gonna hit. We'll close with this. I'll try to see if it can be effective against Dalsam. And even if it is, you're still totally guessing if he's not gonna do the low attacks or not. But if it's changing the dynamic, like if it's forcing him to do low attacks and then maybe you can get a jump in because of it, maybe. It is a meterless reversal. A meterless three frame reversal. Maybe it's good against Fong. <laughs> Fong? Like Fong does heavy kick and then he follows up with the four frame and then you V, v, v skill in response. And then he mashes on sweep and you die. <laughs> okay, let's just try like this. Where's my dash? Okay. Down, this, and then this. Start the recording, back dash, and then do it. Oh! Wait, what? Why is he getting up? What? Now it's not? Why didn't the other thing cause a... Why did one cause a hard knockdown and this one is not? Am I missing something? Does it behave differently? Or did the, the character just not get up? Let's see. Let's try a different normal, I guess. I used a heavy attack with Sakura, so let's try a heavy attack with Sim. I don't know. I have a feeling that I'm not correct about this, but. <laughs> that stinks. <laughs> And now it's a hard knockdown, so maybe against heavy attacks it causes a hard knockdown. This is... This is on... Oh! This is because of my recording. This is not because of... Okay, okay. So I don't think it does... I don't think it's a hard knockdown. I don't think so at all. I think it's more to do with my recording. So that means you can get the V skill, but not a lot of Oki off of it. That sucks. So in that... With that in mind, then this is better. If you're just gonna throw something randomly out. Maybe, but this brings you closer into Dalsim. He's gonna punish that better than he would something like this. It doesn't work against specials. 
Doesn't work against low attack, specials, critical arts, and something else that I'm forgetting. But overall, I think she's fine. Anti-air was worse. Let me just review this real quick. Anti-air is worth standing medium punch. I don't know. Stand light kick nerfed. But her standing medium punch seems like it's still intact. Like, I'm sure you can still do this to that. She'll be alright. Nerf, but she'll be alright. It's garbage. I wouldn't go that far. I wouldn't call it garbage. If it's giving you more utility than V Skill 1 in a matchup, then it's an improvement. But if the character is already doing well, she's already fine, then it's so it's, a, it's all right. <laughs> you guys are so extreme. You know how long it take it took me to make that tweet this morning? I was a little tired, but I'm like, how can I express this? I, I said this yesterday, you know? If I eat a peanut butter sandwich, does that mean bologna sandwiches are trash? Nah, man, I'm just eating, eating peanut butter. That's what I got. That's what I like today. Peanut butter sandwich. So I guess, you know, Sagat's not viable anymore. You got that peanut butter sandwich, huh? Alright, I'm done.